what's going on? Now, I want to give you something important that I've heard through the grapevine. Now, I'm not saying it's going to happen 100%, but what I've heard is that this is from several sources that, that know Mike Tyson that I speak to. Basically, Mike Tyson is saying that in November, if he beats Roy Jones Jr., which I highly suspect he will because he has been training phenomenally and he has the skill, even though he hasn't been boxing for 15 years, he's been retired for 15 years, he still has what it takes to step into the ring and beat someone like Roy Jones Jr. Now, they're both putting in a lot of work to get to where they need to. But I want to touch on a rumor that I've heard. Now, if Mike Tyson beats Roy Jones Jr., what he's been telling people is that he is going to put a challenge to Floyd Mayweather. Now, the amount of money that will be involved in that fight will set a new record, a bigger record than we've ever seen with previous Floyd Mayweather fights. Now, I can confirm that there is a lot of truth to this because there's a lot of people, you know, saying that that Mike Tyson wants to continue fighting. So he's not going to stop at Roy Jones Jr. And he doesn't feel like he's going to lose this fight, this eight-round exhibition match. Now, so that 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 is his plan and he's actually put this together himself and Floyd Mayweather has been told by his friends that this is what Mike Tyson wants to do. The promoters know that this is what they want to do. But the world does not, so you're hearing it here first. Now, there's a number of things that can, can stop this from happening and, you know, maybe, um, you know, the International Boxing Federation won't grant the license for something like that and, you know, an exhibition match, there would have to be several factors involved between the weight divisions and um, there's a lot of issues that can come up that would have to be, you know, crossed in order, will actually overcome to actually make this possible. Well, I, I don't know the, the, the chances of it happening, but there is a, a chance that this could happen. So if Mike Tyson beats Roy Jones Jr., he will put a challenge to Floyd Mayweather and the biggest boxing match in the world will take place at some point next year. It reminds me of Rocky, Rocky VI. Um, I don't know if Mike Tyson has been watching too much of Rocky VI. There's a huge age difference between the two boxes. Um, there's every chance that a license wouldn't be granted, but on the odd chance that it does happen because of the money involved, it will be incredible. It will be a boxing match that, in my opinion, will never be rivaled again. Um, but yeah, it will be incredible if it did happen to see Mike Tyson beat Roy Jones Jr., then go up against Floyd Mayweather, and the amount, the amount of money, it, it would be phenomenal. It would be, both parties would do everything they can to make it happen. Floyd is saying to his friends that he can beat Mike Tyson. Mike Tyson is saying that he is not stopping at Roy Jones Jr. And he wants Floyd. This is some epic stuff. Um... Will we see it happen? I, I'm, there's a slim chance. I guess it, it's actually more than slim. Um, you know, it's 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 all going to be down to what happens in November with with this new boxing bout. But it will be incredible, and history will happen in November, and then hopefully we witness something epic next year. Anyway, you heard it first on MC Rapology's podcast channel. Let me know what you think. Is it possible? Um, you know, what, what, what are the things that could stop it happening? What are the chances of it happening? Let me know. Peace.